So do you have any tips you can give for skincare? The most uh, important thing is that to cleanse your face in the morning and evening. Okay. Uh, to moisturize and the SPF, it's a must even if it's not like summertime. Mm. SPF, we have to wear it every single day. We don't need protection only for UVA, we need protection for UVB as well. Okay. Which are there even if it's not hot outside. And then like professional care, it's good to have a facial at least once a month, if not at least every six weeks. Welcome to my channel. So today is Saturday and I'll be going now to Naked Hair Group Limited to have a quick facial. I'll obviously review the place when I get there, tell you guys how it felt afterwards and obviously tell you the treatments I had, what they did and stuff like that. For some reason I've been getting a lot of skincare collaborations lately. Thank you Jesus. So yeah, come along and uh, let's go to Brixton. So I, I just needed to get yourself ready to fill the consultation form and then if you don't mind to take off your top Okay, that's fine Lay down, cover, cover you with the blanket and I'll be with you in one minute One minute, okay, yeah? alright Great, then. thank you yeah, Cheers Whenever you do these things, they always want you to sign a consultation form just to be sure you're not allergic to any product or you know you haven't undergone laser treatment, blah blah blah. So I've just signed mine. I'm gonna take off my top now and wait for the lady to come and have a quick facial. So it's not gonna be one hour anymore because I came here at 2.30 instead of 2 o'clock. So it's gonna be 2.30 minutes, which is perfect because I really need to get back home to my life. <laughs> Alright guys, so um, let's start the facial. Oh um, no no no! I just always use the razor blade. <laughs> Very bad behavior. Like threading, waxing, <laughs> so painful. What kind of products do you use in your routine for your? Um. Okay, so I just started using cordially products. I use um the cleanser, the toner, moisturizer, <laughs> and exfoliator once a week. Okay, that's good. That's good. So this facial we're getting today, what's it called? I'm gonna do like a deep hydration because I don't have time to do something else. Okay. <laughs> deep hydration. Mm -hmm. So do you have any tips like you can give for skincare? Like just any basic advice? Um, I will say that the most uh, important thing is that to cleanse your face in the morning and evening okay. uh, to moisturize and the SPF it's a must even if it's not like summertime mm. SPF we have to wear it every single day we don't need protection only for UVA we need protection for UVB as well okay. which are there even if it's not hot outside yeah mm -hmm. UVB And then um, 
for like a professional care it's good to have a facial at least once a month if not at least every six weeks okay. With my treatment now what we had was a deep hydrating facial it consisted of an enzyme peel a hyaluronic acid serum a rub 
the vitamin C serum rub. The vitamin C serum, she said, is really, really good for the cold season because it's kind of anti-aging. It's really hydrating. It's a good antioxidant as well. This deep hydrating facial I did is really, really good for the cold season because it gives you enough moisture. Like, you get moisture from the um, hyaluronic acid. You get it from the enzyme peel. The enzyme peel was the black one. that like, it had a bit of a tingling sensation when it was on my face, but it wasn't bad at all. Um, yeah, so when we were done, she applied a cream mask. This is obviously to tighten the skin and just make you feel really fresh. She also gave me like this massage on my shoulder that was really lovely. Like she was just as if she felt all the tension from the trip, daily trip from London to Aylesbury. Like she was just massaging me. I was just like, yes, Jesus, yes. And it was nice. So guys, um, I really don't know what the price of these things are. I'll try and get a price list when I go downstairs to do the rest of the pictures. But you should totally visit this place. It's very close to Brixton. It's close to Clapham Junction as well. And yeah, it's really pretty. Everywhere is so fine. And then it's green. I'm just matching with the place today. Yeah, so I had a good time. Thank you so much, Naked Hair Group Limited, for this experience. I really love it. And then guys, I think the, the universe is telling me to do my skincare routine properly. Not just at home, but even come for professional touch-ups. Because she said it's actually good to do it once a month. Or at least once in six weeks. So just find your nearest skincare place. And if you're in London, close to Southwest London, or even Central London, because the commute is very, very easy between um, Brixton and Central London, just come here, step in here. They treat you lovely. Like, I couldn't even do the filming at the room because the next customer was already here, and Hachi was like 10 minutes in, in 10 minutes. The way she just handled everything, it showed me even, oh, no, 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 this place is actually really good. I really enjoyed their, um, their service from the receptionist downstairs. And for the fact that I even came late and they still tried to fix me in somehow. Luckily for Misha, the person for 3 o'clock cancelled. He thought she wouldn't have taken me even at 2.30. So when you're coming here, please don't bring any African time here. Just come on time. Don't bring any lateness. Just come and enjoy yourself. Guys, I'm really loving this life of skincare every damn time. Like, it's a good life and it's just the best. <sighs> thank you so much for watching my video guys um if you enjoyed this please click the thumb up button the like button that thing that has a thumb like this mm, just click it and then subscribe if you haven't subscribed so you join my family when you subscribe also click the bell so you get notifications whenever i post drop a comment because i really love to read from you see you on the next episode Bye bye